In this video, we'll look at the difference between union and union all in Oracle SQL. Union and union all are both set operators. This means that they operate on sets of data. They both combine two sets of data into a single result set. We can see an example down in the bottom corner there. So what's the difference between the two? The difference relates to how they treat duplicates. The union keyword removes duplicate results from the final result. Union all keeps any duplicates. The way to remember this is that the all keyword means show all records. Because of this, the union all will show the same number or more records than union. What about performance? The union keyword performs this extra step of removing duplicates, the same thing as adding a distinct keyword. So it's usually slower than just having a union all. So which one should you use? I suggest that unless you actually need to remove duplicates, you should use union all. This is because it's usually faster. But if you do need to actually remove duplicates, then use union. Let's take a look at some examples of this. We're going to set up some sample data here. We're going to use two tables, one called old names and one called new names. They both have an ID and a first name column in them. Let's run these two statements to create those two tables. Now that the tables are created, let's populate them with data. We're going to insert four records into each table. In the old names table, we're putting in records 1, 3, 8, and 12. And then in the new names table, we're putting in 3, 8, 9, and 11. We can see that records 3 and 8, John and Sarah, are common between both tables. This is where we'll see the difference between union and union or. Let's run these queries here we can see that all the data was inserted. Now, let's run our union query. We're going to select the ID and first name from the old names table. Then we're going to use the word union and then select the ID and first name from the new names table. This will work because we're selecting the ID, which is a number and the first name, which is a text value in both cases. This will combine the results from two tables. We can see the results at the bottom here. It shows six records. It shows records with ID 1, 3, 8, 9, 11, and 12. So why does it show six even though there are eight records in the tables? This is because Union actually removes the duplicate records. The two duplicates we have are ID 3, John, and 8, Sarah. It doesn't actually matter which table that they are removed from in the results set here. Oracle just removes them from the result set to make sure that the values are unique. As a result, it shows six records. Let's run the same query here, but we use union all instead of union. We're still selecting the same data from the same tables. If we run the query here, we can see there are eight records showing. This shows the first four from the first table and the first four from the second table. Records with ID of 3, John, and 8, Sarah are shown twice. This is because union all does not remove the duplicates. Let's take a look briefly at the explain plan to see how they're differently run. We can see the explain plan for the union performs two table accesses on these two tables here, old names and new names. It then does the union all. Then we have a sort step with options of unique. This is the step that actually does the unique part of the query. We can see the total cost is 6 here. Now let's run the explain plan for the union all version. We can see it still does the two table access steps here and a union all. It doesn't have that sort unique step in the middle there and the total cost is 4. So we can see that the cost is slightly less using the union all method when compared to union because it doesn't have that sort unique step in the middle. So that's what the differences are between union and union all in Oracle SQL. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel by using the big subscribe button on the page to keep up to date with all the Oracle SQL videos that are released. Also, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment as well.